When you think about the community of Washington, you may think of a safe small town, but you might not think about the people who keep us safe. I greatly respect them. I think that they're uh, good-hearted people that um, are re really care about their community. I mean, some of them are all right, but most of them are not cool. They're getting more like involved in everybody's lives. They're looking for like bad stuff because that's their job. Sometimes people think that police officers are just out there to because they were, you know, picked on in school or they want to be the bully or whatever else. But we're not out there constantly looking to give people tickets. That's just part of our job. But otherwise, our job is, is to serve the public. I feel like some police officers are there to help, but I feel like some police officers, they want to like not hurt you, but like not help you. When we walk around town at some of the events, you'll hear uh, parents you know, tell their little boy or girl, oh, don't do nothing bad, the police are going to arrest you. I really wish they wouldn't do that because then that makes the kids scared that every time they talk to the police or they might do something wrong that they're going to get arrested and then they're going to grow up not liking us. A couple times, like, some police officers told me some stories to, like, scare me straight. Like, their son, he overdosed on heroin, and he said that if I keep going down the road, I'm going down. He doesn't want to see me do something like that. Some teenagers feel police officers treat teens more harshly than they should. They get on teenagers more than they do older people because they don't know their rights as much. Pulled me over for no reason a lot. Probably because I'm young and dumb. However, it's not just teens that feel police profile them. It really kind of comes across all ages and genders and, you know, nationalities. I took a call the other day uh, that uh, we were actually harassing what he would call the working man. It's no longer a black issue or a white issue or it's a young issue. Now we're harassing a, the guy just trying to make a buck, trying to go to work. Uh, those people that use that excuse are the people that are always in trouble anyway. They try and make that an avenue or an out for what they do, when it's just uh, their behavior or their attitude that's the issue. The segment of, I guess, society that throws a negative light on law enforcement is very, very small. I like to call law enforcement a necessary evil. You guys don't want to see us stop you, but you're the first ones to call when they're you know, being beat up by a spouse or uh, their house has been broken into. We were hired to do a job and that's to protect this community and we're going to do what it takes to protect the community. More and more people feel the police bully or profile. It's voiced everywhere from social media to song lyrics. But police in Washington want everyone to know that they are here to serve and protect our community. From Blue Jay Journal TV, this is Courtney Wheeler reporting.